Good morning, dear children. Let's continue with lesson 14 of EVS, that is Earth and its neighbors. Now look here. What happens to the sun at night? Earth moves all the time like a top. Children, top is a toy, a toy which moves all the time. Okay? Have you ever seen a plate with a top? Children, top is called lat. Two in Hindi. So, have you ever seen or played with a top? Some of you might have. Yes? So, Earth's movement is similar to that of a top. Due to Earth's movement, when the part of the Earth we live on turns away from the sun, the sun's light does not reach us. This is night. Now, children, Earth keeps rotating all the time. It keeps moving all the time. But we cannot feel that movement. We cannot feel that rotation. Now children, when the part of the earth we live on, due to its movement, when the part of the earth we live on turns away from the sun. Now when the earth keeps moving all the time, some part of of the earth turns away from the sun. Now imagine you live on this part of the earth. Now this part of the earth is away from the sun and this part is directly facing the sun. So that is why this part of the earth is experiencing night because the sunlight cannot reach this part. Whereas this part is directly facing the sun. That's why the sunlight can directly reach here. That is why this part of the earth can experience day. So the people who are living on this part of the earth, they will experience day. And if you are living, now imagine yourself living on this part of the earth, then what will you experience? You will experience night because it is turned away from the sun. This part is turned away from the sun. That's why. Okay. So the part of the earth which faces the sun experiences day. And the part of the earth which is away from the sun experiences night. Okay. So, the same thing is told over here. But the sun can be seen in some other parts of the earth. It is daytime there. Okay? Jab ye earth rotate karta hai, jab ye earth move karta hai, to iska ek part sun ki taraf face karta hai. Jo part sun ki taraf face karta hai, vaha par day hota hai. Aur jo part Sun se dur face karta hai, vaha par night hota hai. Okay, children? Now, children, let's continue further. Do you know what moonlight is? Moon. The moon is our nearest neighbor in the sky. So, children, which is our nearest neighbor in the sky? Moon is our nearest neighbor in the sky. It is much smaller than the earth in size. And moon is much smaller than our earth in size. Okay? It is much smaller than the earth in size. Now, you'll understand about moonlight. The moon shines in the night, but it does not have light of its own. It reflects the light of the sun, which we see as moonlight. So children, the moon shines at night, but it does not have light of its own. It gets light from the sun. Have a look at this picture. You can see sun over here, moon over here and earth over here. See sun is giving light to the moon and the moon reflects the light of the sun which we see as moonlight. Okay, so the moon shines at night but it does not have light of its own. It gets light from the sun and this light is reflected on the earth. And we call it as moonlight. Okay? 
Now children, our next topic is changing shapes of the moon. So to understand about changing shapes of the moon, you need to watch a video. Okay, so I'll share a video with you and you have to watch it. After watching the video, you will read page number 97 of your book. Okay. So children, I hope by now you have watched the video. So let's continue further. What are the shadows on the moon? The moon's surface is like the surface of the earth. It has mountains and valleys. So children, the surface of the moon is like that of the earth. It has mountains and valleys. Large bowl like pits on the moon's surface are called craters. So, these are large bowl-like pits. Ye bade bade gadhe, jo moon ke surface pe hote hain, inko kya bolte hain? Craters. Okay, what they are called? They are called craters. We see all these landforms as shadows from the earth. When we look from the earth at the moon, we see all these landforms as Shadows. आप जब Earth से Moon को देखते हो, तो आपको उसमें कुछ कुछ shadows, कुछ कुछ परछाइयाँ दिखती हैं। तो ये क्या होती हैं? ये actually ये craters होते हैं, okay? जो हमें Earth से shadow की तरह दिखते हैं Moon पे। Understood? So what these shadows are called? They are craters, okay? All these neighbors of the earth contribute in their own ways to our lives. So the sun, the moon, stars, they all contribute in their own ways to our lives. And where we live? We live on the earth. Okay, children? So children, here we finish lesson 14 of EVS. I hope you have understood the lesson nicely. Thank you.